Guys, we just reached scale down after the Grand Prix, as a Bank Circuit, and we are the same place as we came for breakfast yesterday. That is uh, Nasi Gandhar Kalita. It's supposed to be a very famous joint, a very far joint. This is what it looks like. It looks more like a food court. Um, our taxi driver, Mr. Zach, uh, it's delicious. It's delicious that I should try the mutton soup here. Yeah, mutton soup and the, the Nasi Gandhar. So, David's got himself a Nasi Kandar. Yeah. So, what all do you have on the plate? Some uh, potato beans and some other veggies. Yeah. And rice? Yeah, yeah, and rice. <coughs> Looks good. Yeah. Let me know what it is. Yes. Coconut rice, huh? Hmm? Coconut rice. Coconut rice. Nice. So, I was waiting for my uh, modern soup. I heard it's really good. I heard it had some really good reviews with the, you know, the people serving here as well. So. Let's try it. So we have the mutton soup here as suggested by the driver. So let's just give it a try. Frank Nogri says that it tastes really good. It's like a bowl filled with happiness. The meat is so. Um, this is this is actually lamb soup. Lamb is having the beef soup. Trust me, the meat is truly cooked to perfection. It is absolutely amazing. Probably like one of the best. Uh, no mutton soup, but we never try it because. Uh, we, you know, I, I've, I've drank a lot of mutton soup at home, back home, where we ate a lot of mutton paya and, uh, you know, the, the, the goat leg soup. But this is like nothing like it. This is totally different and it's so flavorful and so good. And it's probably like the first. This is not nalli. This is proper meat. Nalli, nalli is like the, the marrow, the bone marrow. There's nothing like I've ever tasted before. It tastes amazing. So we're going to try some nasi kandar where you have. Typical coconut rice, Malaysian coconut rice, and a bunch yeah, of other things here. Start from, man. I really don't know where to start So you get from a juice everything. from a variety of meat and seafood, and some kick-ass babies. You top it up with the rice, and you can see one being made right there, a couple of them being made right there. Lobster, yes, lobster. It's crab. It's a crab, oh. Squid. Squid. Amari. It's chicken. Chicken. Barang, narang. Fish. Yeah, like so many things to choose rice, from. Man. So, we're putting a lot of rice. We already had some oh, amazing yeah. beef soup. We don't feel like having some more. I don't feel like having some more. I mean, a lot more rice. So let's see. Let's see what looks good. We need to get a, a generous amount of food because we haven't anything eaten. I think it's almost since the afternoon. And, uh, let's see how it goes. Uh, what is this? Same? Same, same, huh? Now, what is that? Same. What is this? Um, honey chicken. Honey chicken. Uh, no. This? Chicken? Tandoori fry. Now give me some, uh, what is that? Crab? Crab gravy? Yeah, next to that? Squid, squid. Okay, yeah, give me some squid. Calamari. The calamari is not like uh, how it is usually. It's cooked in a very different way. It's also soupy and tangy. Here we 
got some cabbage, some toran, and uh, chicken with fried chicken, and some calamari, topped up with some mutton soup. That's different mutton soup, is different. I also got myself a nice big glass of cold Milo, ice Milo. Make all the gravy into mine. This is amazing. Some cabbage. Some chicken. Sorry if you know I'm not giving you to my best. I'm trying to give you as much as I can. We are trying to give you, not give you all as much as we can. I swear, so, man. We're like really exhausted after that. Trust me, I can just stand and doze off. Like of watching the race and we had an amazing time. The experience of watching the watching the, the Moto Moto GP is absolutely so stunning. You know, it's, sensational. It's it's nothing like you never compared to. It's nothing like you know you I know that we've ever experienced. It's probably like a once in a lifetime experience. That's, that's how I would consider it. I consider it. I don't know about the rest of them. Because yeah. I would definitely want to go and watch it's it again. Year, right? But but this is like the first time. It'll always be the, spe no, the most special time because uh, we saw the person who we've idled, you know, who, who we have idled, literally idled in terms of for years, uh, for decades know, together. In terms of racing and in terms of you know uh, riding a motorcycle, that's Randy Rossi. We got to see him directly in front of us. And that's the that's the number there. 46. 46. We are 46. We are 46. So that's where we are at. That's where you know. That, that's, that today. was the best thing. It doesn't matter if he day. if he didn't make it to the top three. Also, he you had know, a good day. He had a good day because you know he gave a really good competition to you know, the fellow riders. Jack and all the other riders. And the everyone, trust me, his experience is what really talks. No matter how old he turns, no matter how. You can see you know, also, also man. Yeah. Good competition. No matter no matter how old he gets, or no matter how you know. Uh, you know, people, people might say that he's you know he's, he's uh, very, very close to his retirement and all that, but trust me, his level of enthusiasm, his I uh, know his his rush and uh, his his skill in riding the motorcycle is absolutely beyond anything else, it's beyond anyone else who was on the track, you know, then and there. So we had a really good time there. We had a ball of a time watching the MotoGP. Really glad that we got to do so. So we're gonna quickly end this video right now. We're gonna end this vlog right now and uh, take you to, uh, to the next no, country where we're going to start a journey in the next video. So stay tuned, do watch the videos, do like, share and subscribe and uh, do comment down below if you all you know, like or don't like the video you know, because I, I know it's been a while reading any of your comments so I really appreciate it if you all do. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you all soon in another country.